D. Rich TV here in Nashville, Tennessee at the Coast to Coast Preps All-American Combine. And to my right, I have one of the top players at the event, Chris Moore. How you feeling today, man? I'm feeling great, man. I'm feeling real good. Now, what brings you to Nashville, Tennessee today? Well, you know, I heard about this Coast to Coast camp, and I just wanted to come down here and see how it was. How do you think it's going to be this weekend? Real great. It's going to be fun down here. What are you looking forward to proving this weekend to the people who haven't saw you play? Uh, mostly like my outside game and sometimes uh, playing the three most of the time. Are you pretty tall, man? How tall are you? 6'5". Can you dribble the ball, man? Yes, sir. What's the strong point of your basketball game, you think? Uh, probably my inside and uh, free throws. What do you need to work on? Uh, not being too shy with my shot most of the time. Would you be kind of shy with your shot? Yes, sir. Well, you, you ever seen me play? No, sir. You got to take after me, man. I ain't scared to shoot that rock, man. You got you to shoot that rock if that's what you do. You know what I mean? So... What do you think about Coast to Coast Preps? It is real fun. I, I've been reading this for a long time. I always want to, you know, experience it more. Uh, when you go against a player that Coast to Coast Prep may rank one, two, three. Now, me, I don't really care about rankings all like that at this age. But I feel like if I'm a kid and I see a kid that's ranked above me, I'm going to go out their neck. What about you? Yeah, I'm trying to go out their neck and take their spot, too. I'm trying to get out there with them. And then once I get out there with them, you know, it's going to be just like that. What do, do you have to do to get national recognition that you would like to have? Really, I think it's, you know, working hard, hustling on the court, and um, showing that, um, I, I mean, staying humble and stuff like that. That's to me. Now, as far as older players, high school, NBA, college, who do you idolize your game after? Mostly, you know, uh, LeBron and uh, Dwight and LaMarcus Aldridge and them. Yes, sir. I never heard anybody say LaMarcus Aldridge. What do you like about his game? I like how he like he could he, he not he not shot with his shot even though he's tall and big even though everybody expects him to be an inside player and stuff he's not just an inside player he's an outside player too. Okay, now who's your favorite NBA basketball team? Um, it's kind of hard to pick, but if I did have to choose, it'd be Cleveland. Who do you think gonna win the championship this year? And be honest, man, go to state right now because them boys are bad. You know they thirteen and zero. It just got they just got done beating the Clippers. A lot of people have been saying something that's really been irking my nerves, man. But I'm going to ask you because I feel like you're going to be honest with me. Is Stephen Curry the best player in the NBA right now or is LeBron James still the best player, man? And be honest, you know. You know, Le I, Le to me, LeBron is the best player, hands down. Because most of the people say that Stephen Curry is the best player because there's points and all that. But, you know, most of the people just don't know the game. Like, how you supposed to really know it in the um, best players kind of uh, talk. Right. When you're on that court, you got to do a little bit of everything good. You know what I mean? So... As far as basketball, what do you think is the most important part? Um, really, you know, to me it's defense and, uh, you know, showing your hustle and stuff like that. Right, defense to win championships, but, you know, offense sells tickets. See, that, that's the truest statement I've ever heard. Well, go out there and ball up this weekend, man. I'm All looking right. forward to seeing you play.